So there you guys have it. This is episode two. Or well, uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> What good YouTube family? Product CDR Fit here with another Ravelry video. And today we're going to touch on the bench press today. We're going to talk about how we are increasing our bench press. Unfortunately for me, it's also one of my weekends. We are a few weeks out from Darwin's competition, so not a lot of time left to uh, make those PRs, make those gains, but we got to make every single day count, and uh, this is what Russ and I are trying to do right now. So we're still doing the same thing, push, pull, leg day. Uh, we also have, uh, for the first three days, the hypertrophy day, so higher volume. And then for the last three days, we do heavier, so less, less reps, but heavier weight. So in terms of PR um, right now, um, if you can relate back to uh, the very first rivalry video when we actually hit our PRs, um, the number that I hit was a 205. And I haven't really tested it yet, but I did do 205 pounds again, and uh, it was kind of a bit of a struggle. I didn't go up as, as easily um, as the other one did at all. It kind of sucked, like I said. But uh, 205 is, is where I'm at right now. It hasn't really changed. It is what it is. I mean, I'm not gonna come to you guys and be like, hey, I'm not doing well, or like I'm saying another number. Right now it's 205, and, and it stayed at 205. Right now my PR is about 245 pounds. So I hit a I hit a PR of about 20 pounds. And I think it's like it goes a bit slow right now because I feel like chest, or at least for bench press, it's just hard to to increase your strength. But I'm trying to do different things to increase it slowly. So one of the things I'm doing is during uh, either heavy day or for hypertrophy day, uh, after the other guys like finish their workout, I like to stay on the bench press a little longer just to get more volume in, at least three or four more sets. Uh, I like to do pause pause reps and then just kind of going halfway, or I like to do, I don't, I don't know the real term, like the real word for it, but I like to go just halfway as well from, from the top and then also halfway from the bottom. So just doing half reps and then also doing full reps, but pause, pause reps. So obviously my goal for this PR, like I said originally, was to hit that 225. That's still the goal that I want to hit. Um, like with limited time left remaining really that's kind of where i want to get to i don't want to be overly optimistic of where where i want to be because my bench is one of my weaker lifts you know just trying to stay positive trying to build myself to, to get to that 205 um i've hit two plates on my other lifts and uh, i'm just waiting to hit those 225 on that bench press just so that i can finally do two plates all right so we got about three weeks left until we go into peak week or before darwin's competition so hopefully I can get my strength to at least 255 pounds. My ultimate uh, PR for bench press, I've never hit that before, especially at this all-time low, or at least for this weight, I'm about 151 right now. I'm slowly trying to cut down because of Darwin's competition, I want to also look good and feel good. So I've been cut down a bit, so my strength might decrease or might not increase as fast, but I'm hoping to maintain at least my strength so that during peak week, Chris and I can can have a good battle and see who comes up the strongest. Uh, guys, don't forget to root, down, root for Chris because you know he's kind of slacking on his bench press. <laughs> in terms of what I'm trying to do in order to hit that PR, um, prior to even before this rivalry video, um, I rebuilt sort of my bench press in terms of like my form and um, making sure I was staying nice and tight, being able to you know arch my back and be able to just have like my shoulder blades on the um, on the bench and then my butt and then just have that sort of arch um, so I can have more explosiveness and more, more leg drive. Form is not the greatest and that's what I've really been trying to stress on is, is my form. So uh, playing around with the bar in terms of where I want like my placement, you know, I, sometimes I go a little bit too wide, sometimes I go a little bit too too close. So I'm still trying to find that sweet spot just to make sure that I can come down and be able to explode it off my chest and then just be able to kind of uh, muscle memory and have that ability to push the weight really, really well. Also, another thing that I've done just to help uh, make sure that I've had more balance um, in my arms, because I probably do have muscle imbalances in terms of uh, my chest. I've been doing flat, uh, yeah, doing flat dumbbell chest press, and just making sure that I can be able to isolate uh, both, of, both my left and my right chest, and then be able to 
to exert the amount of the explosiveness so that I can be able to translate it to my actual bench press. Come on. Pull that shit. Come on. Nope. <laughs> Basically, my main plan is just to do higher volume and practice locking out and also bring it to my chest and uh, use, doing those pause reps just so that I can have more explosiveness. So those are just my little tips. I'm not doing too much because I'm not sure like what really helps with chest, but also maybe my triceps and also some shoulder workouts, like just like little accessories just to help overall get up that weight uh, for bench press because those those parts also help contribute to your chest. So yeah. Hey, bye. Hi, if I grind, what's this? Oh. If I grind, I'm pretty sure I can do it. Come on man, come on. Come on man, come on. Be mad man, be mad. Let's go. Come on. Easy. Easy, Let's see what you've been waiting for. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Push, push it, push it. Push get it up, get it. up. Got it. Fuck yeah. Good, good, good. Well, I also mentioned that I got a new belt. I got the Rise belt, the nice baby blue. I really like it. I'm just trying to break it in right now. That's why I'm wearing it. I'm hoping that this will also contribute to all my PR strengths because uh, having a belt, as you guys know, we have another video about that, how we think it helps increase our strength or at least keeps a, a steady frame or stability, whatever. Check out that video. So that's uh, our third video for Rob the robbery with Chris and I, and that was for us to show you how we increase our bench press. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.